Pollinate Energy has been operating for a little over a year now, uh, and in that time we've reached almost 500 urban slum communities right across Bangalore. Uh, we've also sold around 3,500 solar lights, and we're looking to introduce more products that can improve well-being, such as efficient cook stoves, water filtration and sanitation. One of the biggest challenges our organisation faced was how to recruit the pollinators, who are the micro-entrepreneurs. Uh, we overcame this challenge by partnering with local organisations who already had access to the kinds of people that we wanted to be recruiting for these positions. Um, and through those partnerships we were able to find the right people who gave the best quality to the job that they had to do. Having reached all the regions in Bangalore, we're going to be expanding into Chennai uh, in the coming months and later into Hyderabad. And beyond that we hope to be able to reach five new cities every 12 months. Um, in terms of products, we're researching new products that are available in the market which are suitable and affordable for the people living in the urban slums and hopefully uh, in the long run we can introduce many of these products and help them in their day-to-day -day lives. Right now, families living in urban slums are forced to rely on fossil fuels for their energy. Um, this creates problems such as indoor air pollution which is detrimental to their health and Pollinate Energy wants to completely change that. We want to take affordable, sustainable technologies and put it into the hands of these people that need it most so that into the future they can preserve their health, they can have better conditions that they live in, help their children study at night and many other benefits that come from such products.